Healthy Place viewers, this is Sarah Hackley, and today I want to talk about fear. Those of us with anxiety disorders all have an underlying anxiety problem that impacts our day-to-day -day life. But many of us also have specific fears or phobias that really impact us on very particular events at different times. And those fears and those events can actually make dealing with our underlying anxiety even harder unless we do something to address that fear. For instance, I'm about to go on a plane to a conference and I hate flying. I spent my childhood on a plane and I didn't have any problem with it then, but these days, the as my anxiety has gotten worse, my fear of flying has also gotten worse. So I've come up with some techniques to help ground myself and calm myself before the flight so that I don't experience increased levels of anxiety my entire trip. Um, you can do these things too. It's usually the same stuff that you would do just to manage your underlying anxiety, but you do it at a more specific point in time. Um, for instance, I've talked to my doctor about taking some of my um, anti-anxiety medications right before I get on the plane. I also practice deep breathing as I go down the tarmac and I do a very personalized grounding technique where I walk through and I put my hand on the side of the plane just as I walk through the door. For some reason, for me, that helps ground me and bring me back to the moment and really reduces my overall anxiety. And those three things together make it where I can get on the plane and I may still be kind of fearful, but I'm not going to experience a panic attack. I'm not going to spend the whole time that I'm gone um, with ramped up levels of anxiety and feeling all on edge. So that helps me a lot. Um, you might try finding something like that for you with a specific phobia, whether it's fear of speaking or doctor's appointments or whatever else we all have that, you know, bother us individually. So that would be my suggestion. Um, I hope that helps. Thanks, y'all.